We'd go out to the neighborhood and, you know, we thought we were liked and Willie Willie would come in and then all of a sudden it would be Willie. And Chief William Gross is proud to be one of those friendly faces. He's a staunch believer in community policing. I'm a student of history. There was negative history going back 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s. But through the vision of forward-thinking leaders that brought on community policing, it changed us from being the warrior class to where we work collaboratively with the community. Chief Gross was the city's first African-American police chief. He will soon become Boston's first African-American police commissioner. I really appreciate the confidence that you have in me. He doesn't take it for granted. I am a true street cop. I started in Dorchester, 1985. His single mother raised three children in this Dorchester neighborhood, including a son that rose the ranks from patrolman to the gang unit to the night command. If you want change, be the change. That's why I became a police officer. He credits the second parent he calls his community and that tough mother. I told her I was getting a national community policing award today. <laughs> So we didn't tell her anything. Let's hope that other people can achieve this, you know. There are kids out there that don't think, oh, we can't do this. This is never going to happen. But it can happen. It is a big job promotion and one without its challenges.